Hello traders, today's top stories, Wall Street indexes will be tested today and investor sentiment is fragile. It's Wednesday, March the 22nd and here is our New York Review. U.S. equities are expected to open under pressure again today after yesterday's fall across the major indexes. Housing sector data via the existing home sales figures will be released today along with crude oil inventories. The recent slump in crude oil values may be having some effect on Wall Street as banking and oil companies have met headwinds in the equity markets. However, it is important to note the losses made on Wall Street early this week have not been a disaster and the Dow Jones and industrials, S&P and Nasdaq all remain well within the higher realms of their value ranges. Investors should be ready to have their sentiment tested for the rest of the week. The Nikkei index led the losers across the Asian equity markets today as risk adverse trading showed its teeth. All the major Asian composites declined and showed no ability to emerge from the downturn this morning. However, trade balance numbers from Japan released early today beat its estimate and the oil industry's activity data met expectations. The yen has risen in value against the US dollar in a show of force. The fact that the yen is getting stronger is a sign risk adverse trading may linger in the Asian markets and traders should have their risk management in place. Current account numbers have been published for the European Union and the outcome was much lower than anticipated. The data is a reminder economic conditions across Europe remain challenging. The UK will release important retail sales figures tomorrow. Yesterday's inflation statistics from Britain were better than expected. The euro and the pound have both made gains against the US dollar and are near important short-term resistance levels while European equities including the DAX and FTSE indexes are trading negatively today. Gold has increased in value significantly the past day. After initially falling early yesterday on likely profit taking, the precious metal has renewed its assault on short-term resistance and shown the ability to break through to higher ground. Gold should be watched carefully today for further volatility. Traders will look at the existing home sales numbers from the US carefully at 2 p.m. GMT. Thank you all for watching. Have a great trading day, and we will see you again tomorrow.